Hey everybody on YouTube, welcome to the DL channel. And so today we're going to go ahead and discuss about Punk Buster actually kicking you out from the servers. So, um, you know, this video is mostly intended for a non connection that's, you know, between Punk Buster and the servers and whatever their other stupid reason why, you know, Punk Buster has been kicking you out. So we're going to go ahead and uh, jump right into it. i um, going to go ahead and try to make this tutorial as short as possible. So um, what you're going to want to do, um, in my personal preference here, or let's say that's worked for me so far, you know, I can't say if it's going to work for you, but, you know, it worked for me so far. But um, what you need to do, go into your start menu, I'm running Windows 7, go into control panel. Now, what you're also going to do now, um, you're going to go to uh, System and Security, and then Windows Firewall. You're going to go into Advanced, right here, Advanced Settings. Now, just got to go ahead and wait. All right, now, next, you're going to go into Inbound Rules. You know, you don't need to mess with outbound. You don't need to mess with connection security rules or monitoring anything. You need to go to inbound rules. So, as you can see on the list here, we have Punk Buster A and we have Punk Buster B. Now, if your system shows multiple A and multiple Bs, you know, that's fine, whatever. Go ahead and delete them. You only need one Punk Buster A and you only need one Punk Buster B. So, you know, since I already done that before this video, you know, we don't need to we don't need to do that. So what you're gonna do is go onto there, you know, just right click and go to program and services. Right here, program and services. Now, by default on your system it show it should show by default it will say this program what you're gonna do is just go ahead and change it to all programs that meet the specified conditions and hit apply and then just hit OK you do that on both you just double click on the other one same thing and hit apply and then OK and so that's that's it with the fire with the with the fire uh, wall settings so now we're just going to go ahead and exit out of that. You don't need this anymore. Now next, you go into your um, into your um, into your folder where you have a uh, Battlefield 4 at, and in this case, it's on my other hard drive. So PC games, and then uh, Battlefield 4. Now go to installer. Now when you get into installer, go to Punk Buster. And now go to redist. Now, this part is pretty much self-explanatory. I already done this, you know, right before the video too, so I'm not going to get into, uh, you know, redoing it. But, um, but pretty much, you go ahead and run this. It's an application. It's all self-explanatory, and run it through. And when you're done. You know, it's also optional. You can also restart your system, and um, you know, I I didn't restart my system, and you know, I'm still playing the matches without getting kicked out. You know, I'm still just having that high ass ping error. But you know, once you get done running this application, you should be fine. So you know, that's about it for Punk Buster for this video. So um, remember to like, comment, rate, and subscribe. And, um, you know, until next time, have a good night, have a good evening, have a good day, wherever part of the world you're at. Alright, thank you.